you hold my hand, look me in the eyes. You and me, yeah, that's all I need, and I'll be alright. I'll be right here. I swear that I'll stay here with you. dentist appointment this morning she canceled school so I didn't take London to school because their appointment is at 8 30 this morning and today's a half day so I'm not even gonna bother with school today and they get out at 11 anyways and they have an appointment right now so we're heading to the dentist appointment to make sure that nobody has any cavities and make sure everyone's teeth are clean and everyone needs to let them do their job and not have to make them use a baby toothbrush. Baby toothbrush. They can't use a baby toothbrush on you. <laughs> no baby toothbrushes on six-year-olds. Or four-year-olds. Uh -huh. And then I gotta go to Walmart, probably, and get more boxes because I just feel like I'm not gonna have enough. I don't know. I don't know how many boxes I need. I don't know anything. You know how small we get? I don't know anything. to come to the zoo for a minute and I always like to try and make it to the, at the zoo Princess Peach. Princess Peach in the so city. we're taking a break from all the packing and everything to come hopefully have a good time even though my legs are already killing me hopefully have a good time here before we gotta go back home to finish packing Check and everything that costume. else that I got to do but
Chase. out on my funnel cake at the fair I had to get one here wish I had some way to cover it up so it doesn't go everywhere when I'm driving but I think I want to try to brave going out to eat with three kids by myself because I need the pick-me-up for one um, and our right whole basically our whole morning? kitchen is packed up anyways that was a bit crazy with Jace he wanted to run around the whole book time and he doesn't know how to like walk with the family and pay attention he just wants to run everywhere and he's cutting everyone off and he's getting too far away and he's not like paying attention not listening things not going the right direction very stressful didn't want to be carried either so I kind of had to chase him around and then eventually I gave up and took the costume off and made him sit in the stroller and he did all right because he was distracted by candy. He basically got into every bit of the little bit of candy he did get. Leave it in the middle. Okay. Okay. Hi, welcome to McDonald's. I'm picking up a mobile order. What's the code? ZB24. Yeah, I broke it. Make chicken meal? Yes. You can pull around. Thank you. You're welcome. In the midst of all this, London has a game this morning. And again, my whole kitchen is packed up. So we couldn't eat breakfast. So I figured I'd grab breakfast on the way. The game's at 11.30. Leaving at 10.30. Okay, but we don't have any bowls or spoons. I decided to leave at 10.30 and I wasn't even like thinking about the fact that 10.30 is when breakfast ends. So we just barely missed breakfast. So we have to get lunch food instead now. But 
it's whatever. It's too hard to eat pancakes in the car anyways. So I'm grabbing McDonald's so that the kids can eat quickly because London will not play if she does not eat beforehand. That's what we learned from the first game. Have to make sure she's well fed before her games and not just snacking. I've actually been up for quite a few hours. I woke up, like I was woken up basically for one, my phone woke me up because Christopher was texting me and two, I woke up having a panic attack again. So, well, an anxiety attack, whatever you want to consider. It wasn't a full blown panic attack, but it was definitely like some anxiety issues woke me up and I couldn't go back to sleep. So I've been up since like 6 a.m. And I was like, I need to be up by 9.30. I don't necessarily want to force myself to get up because it's going to be a long day as is. So I told myself last night, I was like, set an alarm for 9.30 because that gives you enough time to get up, get ready and everything and get out the door before the game. But if you so happen to wake up earlier, then you can just wake up and pack until it's time to get ready to go. And well, I ended up waking up at like 6 a.m. So I like spent the whole morning I'm doing some more packing. I spent the whole morning doing some more packing and then got everyone ready, grabbing food, gonna go to the game. Then I've gotta figure out getting the U-Haul. And I don't even know how I'm gonna upload anything. I haven't really edited. I've gotten a bunch of random clips. I've run out of storage on my SD card so I can't even use my camera anymore because I don't have time to edit. I'm not editing right now and I can't delete anything else because I need the clips and I've already accidentally deleted too much. So I can't even use my camera anymore. I don't know when I'm gonna edit. I don't know what I'm gonna edit. I don't know what I'm gonna post. I don't know anything right now. Vlogs might be a little confusing for a minute. I don't, I don't know. But yeah, after the game, I have to somehow figure out what the deal is with getting the U-Haul getting over to the house and getting everything out technically we're supposed to have everything out today and i'm debating asking them if like they could extend it through tomorrow because it's sunday anyways like what are y'all gonna do on a sunday i don't think that they're gonna be like worried about getting stuff started on a sunday anyways so i was gonna ask and be like hey can you just give us that extra day because i literally only have help on the weekends and it's kind of hard to move an entire house in one day. I was gonna ask about if they could just give us until tomorrow. Like, it's Sunday. I doubt they're gonna be doing anything else to it on Sunday. Thank cookout. you. That's just cookout in front of us. Yes. What does cookout mean? It's the name of the place. No, what does it mean? It's when you cook out. You cook cooking. outside. I don't know. Give your sister hers. Here. Where's London? Where's London? London.
Where's London? Where's Give me all your love, give me all your love 